Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lala. Today I'm going to share with you something brand new from Shea Moisture. Did you know that Shea Moisture has a beauty hack line? It's like every single day they come out with new things. And this one is hot. This beauty hack line consists of different natural products ranging from carrier oils, essential oils, clays to make your DIY clay mask. And I received this packet which came with my Shea Ambassador box number three and I'll show you the contents of that you can see right here but this packet gives you an overview of the different types of DIY products that you can make so there's a Moroccan clay mask and it has the recipe Aztec bentonite clay mask you know I like Aztec bentonite clay a sugar scrub a moisturizer hair cleanser and a body cleanser now what I like about this box in particular is that I am a DIYer. I love to do projects. I love to make products on my own, whether it be from hair care, skin and face, nails, anything. So far on my channel, which you can see in the playlist, I've done a DIY lip scrub, I've done a DIY length check t-shirt, I've done a DIY box braid, I have a DIY shea butter cream, and I have a few coming up real soon. Please be sure to check those out. You won't be disappointed. This box was exciting because we had to come up with our own DIY recipe and you know me, I like to get creative. Once I saw the contents of the box, I merely thought about maybe I'll make something for my hair or maybe I'll make something for my skin. I knew that recently I did a bentonite clay so I wanted to try the Rasul clay but not right now. My main focus right now is on skin so for this beauty hack I decided to go with a skincare video and this is going to be my DIY skin brightening mask so if you're interested in seeing how I came up with this mask that's highly effective and it's easy to make then keep on watching Mmm, this smells good. Okay guys, so it's been 30 minutes and this is what my face looks like. It's dried and it's stiff and I can barely talk. After I applied it, it didn't feel tingly but I felt a slight like sensation like I wanted to itch like around my nose. It did get tighter but on like the bentonite clay it did not have the pulsation so I don't know if that has anything to do with like the ingredients that I put in. I'm gonna wash this off. 
So I just washed off the mask and this is what my face looks like. Do you think it brightened my face? I think it brightened my face just a little bit, but as you know, when you use products, you have to use them numerous times before you see results. So I do recommend that you use this product, you know, on a weekly basis to see faster results or however much times you would like. To add some moisture to my face, I'm going to be using the macadamia oil because this oil is good for dry skin. It has the acids, omega-3s, and it prevents wrinkles and it hydrates the face. So... I do need that right now because after the clay, I do feel like my face is a little bit dry. This skin brightening mask is very, very effective. With just one use, I saw a lot of great results. Now, this mask is for people who have a lot of acne scars, hyperpigmentation, and any type of skin issues. The ingredients in this mask are all natural and it's great for sensitive skin too. I really enjoyed making this mask, it was so much fun and I think I'm gonna make another one. So let me know if you tried this mask and if you do, please let me know. I would love to see your results as you continue to use this mask. It's not gonna happen overnight. I have to use it on a consistent basis, which I'm gonna use actually tomorrow because I wanna see what it can do for my skin. Have you ever tried any of these ingredients on your hair, your face? Let me know how do you use them. I'm thinking of another DIY project right now. So thank you so much to Shea Moisture and thank you guys for watching. And I hope that you have a great day, a great night. Thank you so much for your support. Keep on watching my videos, more is coming your way. And please share this video, thumbs it up, and subscribe, all right, subscribe. And while you're subscribing, I'll wait a little minute. Oh, okay, so then click the bell button too. You did it? Cool beans. All right, guys. See you guys later. Bye.